Yeah, this your brother Class of Drill Rob back at you with another video. I want to share this beautiful artwork, you know. It symbolizes black royalty, black prestige, being black people just, you know, being together, the man and the black woman being together, unified, loving one another. And you know, I, mean, I love this, you know, and it's a gift, you know, from my precious lady, my lovely lady. Nicole, I love you so much and I appreciate you so much, you know, bringing this home, you know, what it symbolized because, you know, it goes with all my other artwork, you know what I'm saying? I really appreciate it, you know. So I got it on the same wall and this, you know, this is a gift that symbolizes us, you know. Her, and she even got us, you know, she even bought matching necklaces, you know, my lady. You know, I appreciate you so much, baby. We got matching necklaces. Her say, you know, his king, her queen. So, you know, I love that woman. You know, she's still in my life. You know, she decided to, you know, be submitted to me. We're still together. We're happy. We're going strong. We're on the right path now. You know, you know, she she honors me. She respects my leadership, my guidance. You know, and I just love what this this beautiful. You know, black art, what it symbolizes. You know, the black woman is a black queen. She's a symbol of life. You know what I mean? Look what it says right here. She's she's talented. She's kind. She's good. Smart. Pretty. Beautiful. Strong. Important. Successful. She's unique. And look at the black god, the king. You know, talented. Greatness. He symbolizes he's empowered. He's a leader. He's powerful. Focused, intelligent, ambitious. You know, I love this piece of art. You know what I mean? And I just want to keep continue to just keep black love alive because it just seems like society, you know, it's just like we're just socially engineered to hate one another, to have disdain and disgust with black women and black men. Like there's a war between us. I feel the energy when I'm out in public, you know what I mean? But I honestly have nothing but love and passion in my heart, you know, to my black sisters. You know what I mean? I just wish they can live and choose to live a better life because they're living in their lower self. We all have to discover our higher self and reach a, a better form of consciousness where we love ourselves. From the way we eat, from what we put into our bodies, you know? Rather it be alcohol, smoking, and all those negative things. You don't, you know, you'll know when someone really loves themselves. And especially, you know, you can't just love yourself and just be by your, be alone all by yourself. You know, I'm happy to have my black queen in my life by my side, and you know, because I don't want to die alone and be by myself. Have all the success in the world, but you don't have a woman to have a legacy with, somebody to uh, build with you, somebody to grow with you, see your growth, you know. So my black woman, she respects me. She sees me as a black king. And to me in my heart and my eyes, she is my black queen. And we're going to continue to love one another. And that's what I'm going to continue to promote on this channel. You know, so all my black kings and queens out there, you know, that are on the right path, that are on a conscious path, living up to your higher self on a better vibration, on that love frequency, you know, keep doing what you're doing and more power to you. And I love y'all. Y'all stay blessed.